plasma. Now, I sorry if I yeah, just I'll go basic just to make sure we're covering everything. But blood uh, is made up of lots of different things and it has lots of floating molecules in it. Some of those antibodies that um, seem to be in the news an awful lot. It has your the, the, the red part, the red blood cells, which are your main oxygen carrying, and it's got your, your other immune cells amongst bits and bobs. One of the components are these little cell fragments um, called platelets. Um, platelets are very, very important. Uh, they are what causes a scab to form. They're what stops you uh, bleeding, and they do have other functions as well. So for, for those um, of you who, when we talked about inflammation, and um, this was uh, this is these guys play an important part in that as well so they're one of the first things to respond um in that inflammation um uh, process yeah and so, i think that's a really good point to kind of catch up with what luke said oh my god inflammation's good and i think a lot of people are so conditioned with anti-inflammatories being on every shelf mm -hmm. talked about for every disease but if we didn't have inflammation, we'd be pretty stuffed because you actually yeah. need inflammation to heal. And these bad boys are really, really important in getting that going. 